All right, so just this morning, we got a Fortnite reload announcement for November 2nd. So obviously November 2nd is the start of Chapter 2 Remix. And we are a mere two days away. Today is Halloween. Happy Halloween, by the way. So the announcement is pretty simple. This is all they said. This is from the official Fortnite Twitter account. It's time to reload solo. And then it says November 2nd with the big image that says Fortnite reload solos. So I myself have been waiting patiently for this because I much prefer a solo game. It's much, much easier to 1v1 people than it is to 2v1 or 3v1 or 4v1. And normally when I play in team-based game modes, that's usually how I die. I can't ever get into a 1v1 because there's always multiple people around. Now I do love playing with teammates and I actually love doing randoms as well. That's so much fun to me, but I win way more often in solo because I know my skill level and I can always take on a 1v1. But like I said, when there's multiple people, that's when I tend to lose my gunfights. So the real question is how will reload solos work? Because obviously the whole point of reload is that if you die, you can keep coming back and back as long as your teammates are still alive. But when there's no teammates, how does that work? Well, the data miner and leaker FNBR Intel has been posting some information about it throughout the past month and a half. So the original post he made was way back on September 4th, and this is what it said. New reload solo information. You will start the match with one reboot. Once you die, you have to survive at least 30 seconds before you will gain another reboot. When you die, you get spawned to a random part of the map. So that was the original plan back in September. So basically you spawn with two lives, the one that you actually spawn with and then one reboot in the tank. And then if you die, you obviously come back. So you waste your reboot. And if you stay alive for at least 30 seconds, you'll gain another reboot. But then he posted again on October 1st. So a few days later, and he says, Reload Solo has been updated. You now only get two reboots and you can no longer gain any reboots for surviving. So I don't know which one I like better, but you can see he posted a screenshot here and it says reload, last one standing wins, stay in the fight, you have two automatic reboots. So it sounds like you would start with two reboots and then it says during the end game, reboots turn off. And if you have any remaining reboots when they shut off, then it turns into overshield. So that is interesting as well. So everyone apparently starts with three lives, the one that you literally start with and then two in the chamber. And that was the most recent update he posted. So I guess that's how it's gonna start. So not the first way he mentioned, but this one where you get two reboots and surviving doesn't give you any more reboots like he initially said it would. So apparently that's how Reload Solos is gonna work. It's not gonna be for everyone, but for me, that's gonna be an absolute awesome experience. Now remember, they also mentioned getting a new map in Fortnite Reload. So there could be the brand new Solos mode and what we read about the Reload Shuffle. And if that's true, it should be a Chapter 2 map or a Chapter 2 Remix map. So then we could play on the Chapter 1 map, and then we could play on the Chapter 2 map as well, and it would just be random, I guess, which one happens. At least that's what people are saying. So we know for sure that Reload Solos is coming November 2nd. We don't know for sure when this Reload Shuffle is happening. That might happen on the same day, but they didn't officially announce that. So there you go. Another thing to look forward to on November 2nd for Chapter 2 Remix. Let me know in the comments, are you going to be playing the Reload solo? Or are you going to stick with a team-based Reload game mode? If nothing else, it's at least worth a try. So there you go. And by the way, I will be doing my Rave Mellow gameplay and review very shortly, right after this video. So stay tuned for that. There you go. That's all there is to it. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaborTime.